Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome back to another video on the channel. Today we're going to be checking out Papu Gomez's card. And uh, this is a card that looks really good to me. So I wanted to get a review up for you guys. He's about 200k on both consoles. We're actually going to use him in the weekend league. So anything you don't see in this video or further highlights uh, will be included in our weekend league highlights video. Which usually are Tuesdays on this channel. Uh, Tuesdays, Tuesdays are the day for this. So... Take a look at that when it does come out. But 88, Papu Gomez, the man who's carrying Atalanta to greatness with a great mesh of players. He's so good in real life, and he's one of my favorite players in real life. So I want to test him out ASAP. I love the way this guy plays. I think he's so underrated. Um, and so, yeah, 92 pace, 83 shooting, 87 passing, 90 dribbling. He actually does have an inform, so this is going to be his second uh, special card now. Um, and he's got high medium work. It's 5'6", 4-star, 4-star for Papu Gomez is what we got. Then we have 96 acceleration, which is a really key stat, man. 96 acceleration is so fast. 88 sprint speed, uh, 86 attack positioning, 84 finishing, 80 shot power, 86 long shots. Uh, passing wise, he does have some nice 89 short passing. That's going to come in very, very handy. 95 agility, 96 balance to me, combined with 96 acceleration is what I look at with this card and say, wow, this guy looks like he's built different, right? That is some sick combination of stats to have with 88 reactions, 88 ball control, 89 dribbling, and 87 composure, right? A lot of good stuff there. 77 stamina, 74 jumping, and then we've got 46 strength and 59 aggression. So 46 strength is obviously a weak point. Trait-wise, no finesse shot trait, but outside foot shot trait. Um, and then, so overall, I mean, look, you, you got some really standout stats here. You got 87 composure. You got the big balance, the big agility, the, the high reactions, high ball control, um, high acceleration. A lot to like here with El Papu Gomez um, in this uh, in this game. He also gets a lot of links, too. You know, we got him in a team with Maradona, Messi. You got Dybala in this area if you want to do a strong link. You know, you got some Atalanta cards. You got, got things that you can link them with. So we're going to be testing them out, guys. 4-1-2-2, two, and, two, and uh, he's going to be playing striker. I think you could play this guy as a cam, a center forward, or a striker. I would not play this guy wide. I think he's too good to play wide. I would play him in the middle. We've gone with a dead eye today because we feel like that's going to be best for him on top, playing Tiki Taka with Messi and Maradona. We want to have him with the 99 short passing, and then obviously the 95 shot power and the 94 finishing. I'm okay, you know, boosting those and still having the agility, the acceleration, the balance be ridiculous, right? I didn't feel like I had to boost that. All that much so yeah we're gonna get into it now boys enjoy the review and i'll talk after to you guys about what i thought messi gomez <laughs> nah dude i cannot play with this fucking controller bro oh silva Messi, De Bruyne, Gomez, Messi. Oh, that's lovely. Nice one, De Bruyne. Can they forge ahead? Nice. Oh. But it can't get through. Takes the shot. Oh. And both hands. Alaba with the block. Something to worry about here. Oh, good defending, man. Gomez. Oh, I a tried to bridge him. Maradona. A glorious chance. Well, it might still work out. Dude. Who did you sleep with, Adie? Plays with David Silva in the center of midfield, and Alejandro Gomez starts with Lionel Messi. Could go ahead, and still danger here. Gomez, De Bruyne, Messi. Can he put them in front? Let's go. Yes, is the this is next gen, bro. Silva. Now, and in with a real chance. Nah, let's go, man. What a fucking counter, man. Let's go. Dude, David Silva is so good, man. Fuck's sake. He's so good. Maradona. Every pass hitting its target. Magnificent defending. Possession back. Gomez. Could it be Alejandro Gomez? 
We'll take that. We'll take it. We'll take it. We'll take it. A little scrappy. We'll take it, though. This guy is fucking doing some crazy skill combos, man. Maradona. Oh, come on. We need to run. Moving the ball nicely. Looking for that final pass. Dude, I don't understand why it's a red, man. Come on. We got to get this goal, bro. I feel this guy tying it up, man. He's going to tie it up. We don't get that goal. Gomez. Let's go, man. Come on, Papu. What a finish. <laughs> Yo, what is that team? What is that team, dude? No! <laughs> oh, man. I might get slapped this weekend. That was one of the worst defensive plays I've ever done. Like, literally, I stepped to my center back in a situation where I never do because I don't know where my left stick is, dude. Oh, this is not EA's problem, dude. This is my problem, dude. I literally suck with this controller, man. I need to get better at it. Let's go, Diego! What a switch of play, boys! We got five more goals to go, man. We have to get six goals. Go, 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 go! Messi, Papu, Papu, ah, Papu, man! Messi, Diego, Papu, bang! Look at these three little midgets, bro. Taken short. Maradona. Oh, it's done, bro. There's no. This guy's mudded. We mudded this kid, bro. We just mudded him. Let's go, boys. The visitors have totally controlled possession. If you have that much of the ball, you can put pressure on the opposition defense. And they look like the creepy. Look at Papu, man. 46 strength. What a fix that. And it's a quality pass. Element Silva. Maradona. Maradona. Gomez. Oh, Papu. I don't know if that... I don't, it it kind of like froze up there. You don't have too many options. Well, he'd be looking for a brace, the striker. Not to be on that occasion. Kunde. Oh, that pass is brutal. De Bruyne. Alejandro Gomez has it. Lionel Messi. Mendy. Messi. Mendy. Maradona, excellent block. Good work to win the ball back high up the pitch. De Bruyne. Messi. And the goalkeeper covered a lot of ground. And players waiting in the centre. Maradona. Well, making high pressing work for them here. Gomez. And now passing it through. Can they do something positive on the counter attack? Nice ball. Mendy. No possibilities in the center. Mendy. The ball is so bad. Football. Dude, like, this and guy has spent 90 minutes just dribbling around with Ronaldo. Minutes. Just going to the now arena, my dude. Son. Here's Essien. And return to Ronaldo. Nice. Now he shoots. Like, this is the first time. I feel like that's the first time I've seen this guy shoot all game. So, guys, so far, I'm liking Papu Gomez. I'm not blown away. Um, You know, if I were to give him a rating out of 10 and value for coins factoring in, I'd probably give him like a 7, 7 to 8. I don't think he's out of this world. Um, You know, I don't think he's got fake stats. He just feels like a very generic player. He doesn't feel insane. Um, But what I will say is that I'm noticing his attacking AI is very good. 
which is good to see. His run creation is good, and he is very responsive. So those two things I do really like. Um, you know, finishing, not the greatest. Um, that's probably one of the downsides. And then very weak, right? So I've noticed a couple times when we do get in some kind of encounters with defenders, he's getting pushed off the ball very easily, and that is due to his low strength, right? 46 strength is going to yield that type of result usually. So that is, that is because of that, um, totally, I would say. And so, yeah, that's my review on Papa Gomez, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Peace.